All right, so <clears throat> latest and greatest. Uh, it's been a while since I filmed anything. Well, at least for about my car. Um, <clears throat> just been busy with work and stuff like that, and work has been really busy because of the summer. Uh, work is starting to slow down. It's good and bad. Um, good thing is that I get a chance to really enjoy my summer, so I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, the minus, uh, don't worry about the mess in here. Um, and it allow, it allows me to get things done and like stuff like this. I clean up the garage, which I've been cleaning today. It was worse than this. Um, I have things everywhere. It's insane. But <clears throat> recently I left the country. I went with two of my best friends to Japan and we were there for about a week. It was really fun, exciting. I will be putting up videos. I have a ton of videos and a ton of photos. Um, I'm starting to just put some photos up on my Instagram. And uh, my Instagram is um, butcher973 <clears throat> all together. And, um, and Facebook also. Um, and my Facebook is also uh, butcher973. Uh, butcher um, so I, I put a lot of stuff on Facebook. And I'm starting to put some things on Instagram. Uh, a lot of, a lot, I recorded a lot of stuff while I was over there, and I went to a, a few meets, and I did some drifting over there at, um, at uh, Ebi Zoo, and just a lot of cool stuff. So check, check that out coming soon. Um, as far as the car, uh, got the car running. It was running strong. Made 500 to the uh, to the wheels. Um, Everything was great. Everything was running really fine, strong as hell, quick with the new 4.6 uh, rear. And, yeah, everything was great. I was testing it out, driving around. And I think East Coast Bash for uh, Club Loose was coming up. And I think I was like a week away, just a week and away. And I, t I was testing out the car because I just finished putting it all together. I got it all dynoed and stuff. And I just wanted to just test the motor out, make sure nothing overheats, nothing leaks or cracks or breaks, you know, before the event. Because I don't want anything to happen at the event because I was doing the two-day and it was really expensive, you know, fuel and travel and get down there and all that good stuff. So, um, as you can tell, there's no engine in here now. Uh, a rod bearing actually went in the motor so <clears throat> so that sucks um because i just finished putting it putting a bunch of new parts on it and i i mean i redid the motor but the, i don't know the bearing went so whatever it didn't really spin per se like but it was it was a bit rod knock in there so long story short i took it all apart well i was pretty bummed out for for a few weeks um because I, I only really drove the car one, like I don't know a few times back and forth and around the area and stuff like that but I really didn't get to like really pound on I mean I did but I didn't really get to enjoy it and, and drift more than I wanted to so whatever so I sent the machine the, the motor out to the machine shop it is at warrior uh warrior engines um he did a couple of my friends motors and rb25s and stuff like that so he's really good he knows what he's doing he's been doing it for a long long time so I sent the motor over to him um, to get the block and head deck. Um, all the journals were good on my crank except for one, which is I believe it was the fourth, the fourth journal, uh, the fourth piston. That that journal was a bit, um, a bit more scarred. So I had to actually. So he's taking care of it. He's doing. I'm not. I'm no engine you know specialist i don't machine engine so i don't know all i know is i handed it to him and he told me what needs to be done so i just ordered the parts and sent it to him so i ordered a new set i ordered because uh, before it was stock um rods and pistons so i ordered some new je pistons um you know and rings and all that good stuff with it um and tome rods um all doing all new acl bearings again and um and this time I'm going to be upgrading the I'm upgrading to a uh, ARP main uh crank bolts and studs and stuff. So yeah, and then I have to order a new Tomei gasket, which that one wasn't even on there for that long. I'm pretty bummed out too. 
about that so yeah more money whatever you know cars they run they break and you just fix them or whatever so it's cool because i'm just gonna um take it back up let me get that there yeah there we go i'm gonna just take the car back up uh to my tuner and get it all running and um and make even more power so i'll prob my goal is to make 600 to the wheels let's see how much i can really do on pump um, I have all the supporting mods for it, so I should be able to get that number, hopefully. Um, so like I said, I made five to the wheels. I believe at like 18 and a half to 19 pounds. I still have more to go. Um, so with the new rods and stuff like that, it'll be able to, it'll be able to maintain and hold that power. As long as, you know, the, the clutch should hold, um, the clutch is pretty strong too. So, um, not really looking to get a new clutch. Um, I would like a uh, single plate or a twin plate or something, but for the Jay-Z's, they're just way too much money. And already, already, and I am already spending a lot of money extra um, just to get this motor fixed and, um, and with the new parts and stuff like that, so... But good new, the good thing is that at least it'll, you know, it'll, once I get the motor back, I'll be able to slap the parts on and put everything back together and it'll be good to go. So, yeah. So that's the latest and greatest. Uh, I don't think, um, I got all new GK Tech suspension. Uh, I got rear knuckles and lower control arms. That's why it sticks out like this is like 30 millimeters. Just extended is insane. Um, let me see here. <clears throat> you can see the control arms there and knuckles as well. Knuckles are really nice. And I got these little hats here so that I can um, have more adjustability. And, um, the suspension is really great. I love it. I have a ton of angle. So much that it's pretty much ridiculous but i love it um shout out to gk tech for all the impressive parts and uh yeah man so that's about it i don't think i have anything else to say i want to kind of keep it short so but yeah um if any questions just about parts and motor and who knows what comment on the comment box or send me an email or hit me up on Instagram. I'm normally, I'm more on Instagram than Facebook. I'm not really a Facebook user. Um, I don't know why, I just don't really like it that much. But I do like Instagram, I'm on it all the time. Um, again, my Instagram is uh, Butcher973, there's no space. And Facebook is uh, Butcher973 as well. So uh, yeah, so I'll be cleaning up the garage some more, putting some more stuff away and throwing things out. This is my uh, one of my boys' car, his S14. Um, it has RB25 in it, freshly rebuilt, all new bearings and stuff like that. So hopefully that'll be running soon and uh, drifting. So, but yeah, guys, see you.